buddy bomb your close friends. The first time Amy Robich and TJ Holmes met was when they were chosen to host GMA3. What you need to know. I had done parts with Dr. Jennifer Ashton over the years, who I would always turn to for her expertise. In an April 2021 cover article about the pair's third co-host, Holmes said, We were working together virtually every day before being on TV together. We admire one other's adventures because Robich and I come from comparable origins. At the moment, he proceeded by praising their working relationship. We truly appreciate where we are with this program. Although we could have prepared and plotted for a potential concert, this one just naturally developed. Robich and Holmes' friendship grew as they delighted in having weekly conversations with prominent guests. Since Holmes doesn't like cake, she surprised him with a variety of pies to celebrate his birthday on a GMA3 program from August 2022 saying, we're all lucky to be here, and we're excited about another year. Along with being coworkers, Robich and the native of Arkansas are now training partners for marathons. Holmes' response was, by one second, we were jogging side by side, and I was officially ahead by a second. After pictures of Holmes and Robich looking affectionate in New York City appeared in November 2022, Rumors about their romance quickly spread. They have each been married to their partners for a number of years, despite not publicly commenting on the images. The native of Michigan, who has kids named Ava and Analyze from a previous marriage to Tim McIntosh, wed Andrew Shue in 2010. In contrast, Holmes wed Marilee Feebeg in 2010 and had a daughter named Sabine three years later. The former anchor for CNN Sunday Morning also has a child with ex-wife Amy Ferson named Brianna and a boy named Jaden. The twosome was removed from the air one week after their controversy made news, and a rotating panel of TV journalists took their place. Robich and Holmes, who had filed for divorce from Feebig the previous month, were later reported to be out at the network by Us Weekly in January 2023. Two weeks later, ABC made the news official. The broadcaster said in a statement at the time, after several fruitful discussions with Amy Robich and TJ Holmes about various alternatives, we all concluded it's best for them to leave ABC News. We appreciate their contributions and honor their ability and dedication over the years. 